In this tutorial, we are going to look at what is Prezi and what you can do to get started with the service. First, let's go to the Prezi website at www.prezi.com. This tutorial assumes that you have already registered with the site. If you haven't, quickly complete the registration process. Prezi is essentially a presentation service. One of the best ways to see what the service is capable of is watching one of the samples on the front page. By clicking on one of the thumbnails, a new page will load and the Prezi will start to play. You can go through the presentation using the arrows at the bottom. To make your own Prezi, click the Your Prezi's option at the top of the page and then the New Prezi button on the new page. You will then need to choose a template and wait while the template loads. This can take a moment depending on the speed of your internet connection. Although Prezi is different to PowerPoint in many ways, users of the Microsoft program will recognize some similarities, such as the slides running down the left of the screen. You can click on these to edit them. As you click between the different slides, you will be moved to that area of the overall presentation. This provides a very nice transition for viewers. Here we are going to enter some simple information in the first two slides. As well as putting information into the presentation, you can also adjust a great many other things. It is possible to insert frames, arrows, photos and videos by using the links at the top of the page. The Edit Path button will also allow you to change how the slideshow will be viewed. Finally, let's have a look at how you would present this to a group of people. Simply click the blue Present button at the top of the page. It will become full screen and you will be taken through your presentation. Press Escape to close the slideshow. You can also save this presentation by clicking the Save icon in the top left. There are also some sharing options in the top right. This has just been a basic introduction to what is Prezi and hopefully you now have a good idea of how to use the program.